Yeah, he tells me his son was just cleaning out his car here when that suspect came up and started stabbing him. His son then walked the little ways over there to his apartment, leaving a trail of blood behind. I was sitting in there in, in my chair. Thomas Greider was relaxing early this morning when my son banged it, slammed the door open, and then his son screamed, Dad, I've been stabbed and I'm bleeding. Thomas telling police his son's attack was random. The son working on his car when the suspect opened the door and started stabbing him. I thought he was bleeding to death because it, was, it looked like it looked like a lot of blood. So Thomas jumped into action. So I was sitting down on the floor and I put a pressure uh, on him to help stop the bleeding. He just kept hoping his son was going to be okay. Didn't want to lose my son. Police say the suspect got away, but that Thomas and his son know him, and he's allegedly one of their neighbors. I felt very, 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 very upset. Now, Thomas just wants justice for his son. Somebody abuses your child, even though he's 50, 49 years old. He's still my little boy. Now, Thomas tells me his son is expected to be okay, but he did lose a lot of blood. Again, police say that suspect did get away at this time. Reporting live in Oklahoma City, Aaron View, KFCO 5 News.